okay. So I'm gonna play some more WoW. Um, I don't know. I took a bath because I was gonna get ready to like work out and stuff, but it's gonna be like sunny until like two. So I figured I I would like play WoW and then like for like thirty minutes and then go work out. So I don't know. It was uh. I'm going to be frank here. Um, I don't know. Like, I was taking my bath before going... I'm 31. So I was taking my bath before... I, look at this little... The hoofs of this little fucking pony dude. That's, that's actually the funniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. This might be the funniest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. Just like the horse with... The green hooves. Look how close together the hooves are. This is literally the funniest thing I've ever seen. In my life. This might be the funniest thing that I've ever seen ever. Okay. So, I had my OBS on this screen uh, minimized, which looks kind of cool. Because you could see, like, whoosh, which looks kind of cool. Um... Yeah, so right now I feel like I have a lot of boogers. Um, I want to take a bath and like it's so like like I, I've been tanning and working out and running so much. And right now it's like cold, but it's like heating up in my house. <clears throat> so like, I don't know, I think I was getting ready like my body sense this as like a time to get ready to like work out i guess um like just like kind of like this dude over here he's just getting like all ready to to work out like i sat in the bath and that was me. Just like sifting through all the. <clears throat> I accidentally. Check out the little skeleton dudes, dude. It's pretty chill. The. What are they called? First mate? That'd be cool. Just getting like your own like skeleton crew. It's like, come on, boys. <clears throat> Do I know what day today is? It's Pi Day. Today's Pi Day, dude. Basically, I know what day today is. All right, let's let's check to to see what uh, High Overlord Sourfang wants. Oh, the time for pleasantries. Oh, the Twilight Highlands. I read this on one of the boards. Whenever it says War Chief's Command, that means you read it on one of the quest boards. So I'm going to complete that. All right, he doesn't have any quests for me, though. It's kind of cool. You got, like, these dudes standing near, like, the bear. And this bitch in the back. This bitch in the back is, like, she plays, like, fucking... She plays, like, Call of Duty in, like, senior year of high school. <coughs> With like the beard dudes, they got this looks mad cool. Let me record some of this. Let me get myself off screen. So right now I'm looking at one of the flying mounts. I'm not sure what which one it is. It looks really cool. Reminds me of uh nothing in particular. Let's just check it out from over here. I could just showcase some of the flying mounts, I guess. In a video. Like, in general, stuff I like, eventually. Alright, let's just capture this one. This dude looks pretty cool. I guess, uh, I'll capture some of the, the bunny.
Get some of the bunny over here. That's kind of cool. Move my webcam back. Oh yeah, stop recording, right? Yeah, this dragon's not particularly cool. I'm talking shit. Alright, let's see what's going on in here. The collector. Collector trades tender. Here's Horde R Us. I really don't know how to get up here. Like, easily. Like, getting on top of this mountain where the flight path is. Like, I feel like I want to figure that out. But, I don't know how to fly. Like, if I'm able to figure out how to get up there, then it would be a little bit of a cooler game. Maybe it's just as simple as walking this way. Kind of sad I didn't give WoW, like, a chance back in the day. I mean, with with Twitch, it's a little bit more fun. Because you could see, like, all the stuff again later. But I mean, yeah, the PC technology didn't really exist. Which is true, you know? You have, like... Like, I had a PC. Like, I had uh, the Sony Vio. That's a cool sword. I had like the Sony Vio laptop in high school early on. It was just, there's nothing you could really do with it. Like I was editing Adobe After Effects videos with it and stuff. But like the screen capture technology didn't really exist. Like I know Camtasia or Camtasia. That, like, existed pretty early on in, like, 2012. But you had to, like, figure out, like, at least it would have existed in, like, the format of, like, recording. Okay. So it looks like you could get up. So that's the auction house right there. So it looks like you could get up over here. There's actually an elevator, which brings you to the top near the flight master. So you just have to wait. I ran through here before near the gear, and it looks like there's actually an elevator in here. So let's try to find that out. Yeah, so there is an elevator here. I need to find out my whereabouts. Okay. So now I'm up here, but how do I get over to... Oh yeah, so I could just hop down. That's cool. So I... right now I'm at the, like, the... the flight area. So this is how you get up to the second floor so that you could use the flight person. Here's the flying trainer. I can't really train with him, though. Oh yeah, you can. Expert riding. So let's train on this, and then I could fly flying mounts. Master riding requires level 40. Okay. So, let's see. Now, if I hold space, I could fly in my character. That's very cool. So that's how you get up to the second floor, and then also how you fly. Pretty cool. Obviously, that was the auction house here. Um... I wish I knew that. I don't know how to fly downwards. Um, I, I could only fly up. Oh. So, yeah, I guess if you just, like, look down, you could fly down. I don't know why W is going down now. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, so, here's the auction house right here. 
and essentially I took this elevator right here. That's such a it's such a, like a a sad thing to mislead people on flying mounts. But I got a clip for it now, so like why are you making the video, dude? If like you can't actually fly. That's so lazy. Alright, so if you hold space, you go up while holding W. And then if you press shift and right click, then you start going down when you press W. And then if you press space and W, you go up. So that's how you, you fly. See, that's why you should be able to, to edit. Um, that's why you should be able to edit um, your YouTube videos. That's fine. I'm not worried about it. All these noobs, dude. I swear to God. Like, watch a fucking video, dude. I swear to God. I'll add that into, like, my mount video. Like, I'll, I'll make a, a WoW flying mount video or something. Yeah, I'm, like, way cooler than everybody now. I'm, like, significantly cooler. I'm probably the coolest person on this planet. This is ridiculous, dude. Let's see, let's see what everyone's doing online right now. Let me just, let me just take inventory of just how much cooler I am than everybody. Let me, let me put on whoever's on. There's so many, like, quests I could do now. It's kind of obnoxious. Like, I don't even like video games. Alright, so, let's hold space here, I guess. So now, um, like, as you can see, like, this is kind of, like, a new kind of game. Because before, I, I couldn't do this, but now I can, so... I don't know if this means, like, the game has changed, so... Yeah, it's pretty chill. Like, I don't have to fight anybody. I did all the quests. I don't really want to see the area, though. Like, this would have been pretty exciting back in the day. I feel like it was kind of obvious, though, because I, I shared where the guy was, right? And I said, like, to speak to him, so... Obviously, if you buy the thing from that guy, then you speak to the other guy, right? Just make another video, how to fly in WoW. I have to get a better mount first. I'll, I'll make a how to fly in, in WoW mount video once I have like a better, a better mount. In the meantime though, I could just make like a clip or something. It's pretty cool though, I could just like avoid everybody. I feel like this is like my little Bloodborne castle here. Nice dude. Check out this shipwreck over here. So there's actually glass oh my headphone died. Damn it. So there's actually a I'm charging up my other headphone right now so I could work out. So yeah, I mean there's like a um what is it? There's glass armor in a ship in Morrowind. That was kind of interesting though, the one dude who had like, whatever. Echo Isles is kind of cool. It's kind of cool, I could just fly around and stuff. She's just holding like a, a snake. That's a cool statue. I'm looking, I feel like I'm looking at like, whoa. The sea witch. Little sea people. This is cool. Print screen. 
Looks like the the Morrowind uh, Tell Fire area, where you could get the Daedric armor and stuff. Get a a selfie with her. With me in flight. Fine. Alright, so... Oh, you can't heal while you're mounted. So, I'm gonna click in the right click, and I'm gonna hold down W to land. I'm gonna heal. And I'm just gonna fight the... The spit scale sirens. These are some cool designs here. The spite scale sirens. They look pretty cool. I don't know why they have this built, like, right here, though. Like, why not just... Like, have people start doing this right away. Like, you work on... Like, you fight, like, the dude in the volcano, and then you run over here, you do this. I mean, the Yetimus area was cool. And, like, the goo... Like, the green goo area with, like, the dragon and stuff was cool. Alright, so here's the sea witch. I don't know. Can't really fight her. It's a pretty statue. Check it out. It looks like she's holding the sun. Wait. Let me get on my flying mount and try to, like, position myself so it looks like I'm flying, but she's also holding the sun. Alright, so space. And shift and right click. No. Right click and W, okay. Right, perfect. Oh. This is a difficult screenshot, dude. I swear. It won't let me move forward, because this person is in the way. No. It's a space. Is my guy- oh, I'm pressing the wrong button. Okay. I'm sad that, like, my, my dude looks, like, so cringed, though. I guess let me land. Right-click and land. Yeah, Right-click and W to land. So let me get off my mount, and I'll try to get a picture with, I guess, the Sea Witch and her holding the sun. Maybe just her holding the sun. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Okay. So, let me continue. I assume there's quests on here on Dark Spear Isle. Here's the Dark Spear training ground. Yesterday I was showing I was showing a uh, Shura in Old School RuneScape. So, Shura is, she looks like Shiva. Uh, she is a siren in Old School RuneScape, located next to uh, the Nightmare. I think she's there if, like, you die. She's, like, near the chest. It's uh, also known as, like, Fozari's The Nightmare. It's uh, one of, like, the major Old School RuneScape bosses. Ugh. I thought the the sea creatures in God of War were done really well. The new God of War. I think, what is it, God of War Ragnarok or something? I was watching people fight uh, them with, like, chains and stuff. Those were pretty cool fights. And uh, 
I actually saw someone knock in like my video game tile. I saw someone they like hit a rock and like a dragon like flew out of the rock. It was it wasn't like required as a fight. It was like a mini dragon, but it was a cool fight. And he like beat the shit out of it. Kind of near where that area was in God of War Ragnarok, near like the sea people and stuff. That was kind of cool looking. I mean, I feel like Horizon Zero Dawn would definitely be like a little bit cooler to play, personally. I guess, what do I have to like fly around to get quests here or what? Is this another trainer? No, it's just near like the Chocobo people. Alright, so let's repair my, my stuff, I guess. Yeah, let's get my guy repaired. So that's pretty useful. Plus I could like title the stream like how to fly and wow or whatever. Oh they got some dinosaurs here. That's pretty fun. Yeah like why why put these raptors here dude? If like you can't do anything with them. Like I know they had like the like the raptors and stuff like on the way back to the other area. Like, near where it was, like, making me fight, like, orcs within a cave. Where, like, if you go under the cave, or you go above the cave, then you're going the wrong way, and you have to, like, run away and, like, fight them and stuff. It was near where I fought, like... It was near where I fought, uh... Where I first fought, like, uh, it was a little bit before where I fought the Void Walkers. Like, the blue-purple dudes. It was before, like, that White Knight Castle area. I felt like that just like took me on like such a, a huge tangent in the game for no reason. Especially since the people level as you level too. But I needed the gold anyway to afford to fly. I think you need to reach level 30 in order to get the quest for flying anyway. And getting to level 30 takes quite a bit. Are there any quests on here? Boat to the Zolar, Zoldazar. So it looks like the game opens up a little bit here. Like you can, uh, like you don't rely on like the flight paths as much. And you can kind of like take boats and stuff to random areas. <clears throat> like the areas are cool and all. It does take, like, quite a bit. That's nice, though. Like, the game doesn't just end, um, which is kind of fun. I hate how so many of the games just end. Like, I finally got, like, my Daedric armor and, like, in, uh, Oblivion. And it's like, it's red and all that stuff. And then it's like, it's like Oblivion Gate, Oblivion Gate, Oblivion Gate, Oblivion Gate, done. Where is the ship now? The ship departed. She'll be back real soon. Okay, so you have to wait for the ship. It's kind of cringe. I'm out of, out of here. Can you wait in WoW? I don't think you can. Uh, let me press escape, maybe. Escape. No. Okay. You had some flaming skulls up here. It's pretty cool. I don't know why it flies downwards. Kind of annoying. I want to run forward. You have to like hold space, otherwise he like flies down. Kind of annoying. Just fly forward, dude. Very aggravating. I 
don't know if I have to like toggle it. Oh yeah. So if you if you press space, then you fly right up, and then if you click in right click. Hmm. If you click in right click, nothing happens. If you press shift and right click, I don't know. All right, so you press space to fly up, and then you hold space to fly upwards. And you to go downwards, you press right click and W, and then to go upwards, you press space. And then he continues to go downwards, unless of course you right click again, in which case he switches back to normal flight. And then you could hold space to go up. Okay. That's kind of confusing. I swear though, these... Like the... It's not hard to put like a video... Like on your fucking game, dude. I don't know if like they just like sit there and enjoy like watching people try to trash their game on social media like they just enjoy enjoy that it's like watching like oh you could get fatigued while flying if you become completely fatigued you'll begin to drown that's exciting Where are the quests at, though? Like, straight up. I was talking shit about the quest. Where are the quests at? Alright, so... Now I'm at Frey Island. I guess I could fly up here. They got the Whaling Caverns. I could check that out, I guess, next stream. Let's go up to the Northern Barrens. Yeah, it's pretty cool, dude, though. Like, straight up. Imagine flying on Cerberus, that'd be dope. That'd be as cool as, like, the infinite money glitch. And then just, like... In general, just, like, hate watching. Alright, so I'm at Ratchet now. That's kind of cool. What's this? Wanted Captain Garvey of the Maiden's Dagger. Bring the head of Captain Garvey to Garzlo. Okay, that one looks kind of cool. Alright, so, Captain Garvey's head, Northern Barons. Alright, I'm gonna beat this dude's ass and I'm gonna check out the Whaling Caverns next stream. Let me unlock the flight path first. Time is money, friend! Alright, so I got this flight path and ratchet. Nice, dude. Alright, I'm gonna log out. Go run.